Hello, welcome back to Baba951 Gaming. We are playing uh, Terraria. Just got this game on Steam, so let's uh, let's play it. See how see how it is. Uh, from my understanding, it's kind of like uh, just a 2D 8 pixel game. Get a creator character. Can't even see the eye color. What does that matter? Skin. To make it look uh, a bit realistic. Let's see. Alright, give the spray ten look. Clothes. Let's see shirts. Let's get a black shirt. Or black pants. Or. Uh, let's kind of give it. Let's kind of give it matching color. Shoes. Let's do black shoes. Style. Wait, what's, what's that? Oh, okay, so it has a tux. Huh. Uh, softcore. What's that? Uh, oh yeah. I <laughs> don't want that. All right. Uh, click new. Oh, okay, I forgot to create. Uh, let's see, our name would just be... Just have it Baba. Submit. Uh, normal, other world. Alright, I guess we're playing... <laughs> playing this one. I uh, have not played this game yet. Zach. So, it turns out you have a, uh, a sword, a pickaxe, and an axe. So, let's see if we're... So, we're able to chop down trees. And I think you can see right here, it has the uh, 8 pixel, if you can see it. Kind of reminds me a little bit of a, kind of like, Maple Story in a way. This way that uh, kind of is. And I think you can randomly chop it up. Yeah, you can. So you can chop it at the base, which I'm doing right here. You can see like that tiny little black line. It's kind of cool. And I believe if you click escape, We'll be able to go into, I think, our crafting bench. Right? So, yeah, so you'll be able to craft with. If you press uh, escape. So, let's talk to this guy, see what's up. Uh, right click. Here to give you advice. Okay, let's see. How do we craft? What's, what's crafting? So, you're able to get. Huh. So, you're able to make helmets camera mode. What's. what's how do I get out of this? Okay. So I guess we're able to um, get a house, obviously. Uh, we should probably get this, what's this mushroom. Oh, okay. I think you eat that for health. You can see your life right here, by the way. Uh, kind of want to go down. There, there's a bunny. Can we kill it? Oh, yes, okay. So, that just happened. Oh, it looks like there's a bench right here, already made. Alright, let's set it up. Chop it. No. So let's just try to collect some wood. The trees get some acorns. I don't know what acorns do. Uh, is this. Okay, so that's the enemy. Okay, kill it. Oh, okay, so you get you get gold, I'm assuming. You'll probably find like a town or like a merchant or something. For gold. So, okay, oh, okay, so copper. Uh, there's another one right here. Oh, okay. Mushroom. So, this is kind of a, an indie game. That's what it looks like. Stone block, okay. It's like a, uh, like a 2D version, I guess, of Minecraft, I guess you can say. But not really the best comparison for the fact that they're not. I feel like this one's more complex. Even though it's only 2D and 8 bit. Uh oh. This guy, what's this guy do? Assuming it's the enemy. Oh, okay, so it's a lot more tankier and does more damage. Okay, that's not good. So this is 10. 
So I'm assuming with 10 you could probably make like armor or a better sword or weapon. Let's see. And it's about to become nighttime, so what do I do? So slow. Oh, okay, so you have helmet, shirt. Can I get a helmet? No. Oh, there's a die right here, there's an enemy. Uh oh. There seems to be a lot more of these guys coming out at night. And they're more aggressive. A lot more aggro. Ah, so they do a lot of damage actually. Well, I'm at 77 life. Uh oh. Uh, that's not good. So these guys purposely come after you. Uh, let's see. Six. What? Is that a flying eyeball? That's a flying eyeball. Demon, demon eye. And they're trying to kill me. And they do 22 damage. That's not good. So... Is there a way that I can eat these? Oh, what? Oh, okay. So I gained 15 life. What? Okay. Is there a way that I can hide? What the heck? There's a zombie? What? Oh, how do I... Can I escape? Can I run away? Oh my gosh. This isn't good. So they have zombies. And flying eyeballs in this game. Please don't fall. I'm probably dead. Yeah, I... I died. So... From... Vietnam? What? This is Vietnam? Okay, how do I respond? Okay, that's great. Another demon eye. Just what I didn't want to see. Come on. Is this like a safe place? So there's no safety in this game. It's kind of like... If you die, you die. Can this guy help me? Okay, so he kind of helps me, but not really. I only have 10 life. So I'm gonna see this guy. I have no idea what to do right now. I'm kind of... So it looks like you get all of your items. Still, if you're on the easiest mode. Um... And I died again. So, okay. So I found the easiest mode. You, um... I guess you just kind of... Lose your gold. Okay. So I'm waiting for... Daytime. I think... I don't know where the moon would even be. Fallen star, how do I use this? Is that like an attack? No, it's not an attack. So zombies are a lot easier to kill than the slimes because it's kind of like, they're just easier in my opinion. 99 copper, that's a lot of copper. Okay, so is there a way that I can craft something? Workbench. Copper coin. Fifty range damage. Uh so I'm making the workbench. I think it'll pop up in my uh Oh, okay, so you throw the coins. What? Uh oh, 16 damage, that's a lot. 66 copper, dang. Okay, so let's... Workbench. Where can it be placed? So this is a workbench right there. And I think I can only place it in certain spots. 
Okay, so it's a workbench. Not a workbench, but how do I, how do I use it? Interact key? Let's see. Use item, okay, obviously. Auto select. Let's see if that works. Okay, so I can destroy it. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like it can be portable. That's a zombie. I'm gonna take this one, sorry. Uh, can't let this guy attack me, or else I'm probably gonna die. I got wooden arrows. Okay, that's good, I guess. Uh, still, I think that's the timer, so once that gets to the other side, I think I'm good. So this is the first night, and we've died twice. It's a pretty weird game. Uh, how is this ammo, though? That's my question. Okay, nine. I don't see how that's ammo. Okay, so I got that. Collect another falling star, what, what do these do? Uh, it's ammo. Disappears after the sunrise. Okay, so I got tin ore, stone blood, and there's more. There are there's two zombies. Uh oh, oh. Uh. <laughs> okay. Let's see if I can get a two and one kill. Two. Oh, uh oh. Oh no. No. No, 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 no. Uh oh. It's an it's a eyeball thing. Uh oh, this isn't good. Uh, no, 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 no. No, stop. So I guess I'm just going to stay in this hole for cover for now. Until that zombie gets over here, then I have to move. Uh. Uh. Okay. So I'm up in this little dirt shelter, and I'm all good. They're probably gonna come in here. But hopefully it becomes daytime soon. Yep, he's fallen in. He actually just walked right past me. What's that? A demon eye as well? I don't look like those ones. Uh, they're falling. Uh-oh. This isn't good. Okay, so I got a silver coin. There's a demon eye right here. Can I kill it? No. It's a clay block. So what happens with shooting stars? That's I'm confused with this whole this whole game. Oh, what the hell did you? Whoa, what the hell? Is it, that thing just killed like 80, 80 zombies in one. Okay, so now it's daytime. I'm gonna kill this zombie right here. Cause now they stopped attacking me. Okay. Oh, there's a worm. Okay, so. 
Our okay, so that was the first night of Terraria. I'm assuming nights get harder and harder. Uh, so let's try and you know create some shelter. Uh oh. Come on. Come at me, I dare you. Uh, come and get me. And he's dead, okay. So the first night gives you a lot of copper and silver, which supposedly are tools, which I don't think they really are. I'm still trying to figure out how to counteract. Okay, so this is the mini-map of what I know so far. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out how to interact with this gravestone. I don't know. I don't know what this is. Uh oh. What? I can't. I can't even attack it. So, uh, I still can't... I'm confused right now. So, okay, so I have my crafting... Oh, okay. So I have... I can get a wood helmet? Okay. I need these guys to stop attacking me so I can work. Okay, so workbench. Oh, okay, okay, I see. So you stand on top of the workbench, and when you stand on it, you're, okay, that makes sense. So once I'm standing near it or on it, I'm able to make more things. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Uh, a dirt wall, what? Okay, so how do I make a wooden helmet? Okay, so I have one. kind of jump real quick there we go okay so okay so you right click to equip and when I sit on this uh, I have a chair wooden wall So I think this is a weapon now. No, it's not. It's just flashing off my bling bling. Okay. So this is a pretty interesting game. It only costs, I think, like ten bucks on Steam. So ten dollars. I mean, if you like. Indie games. It's pr it's pretty good. It's it's just a random game. That's all I can say. It's one of those random but yet fun games, kind of like Unturned, but Unturned is free. Unless you buy the gold or the premium upgrade. So okay, so now I'm able to make a hammer, a wooden sword. Okay, so how do I make a wooden sword? Okay, so wooden swords actually deal more damage. Okay, so now I'm gonna be able to do more damage. Awesome. Uh, wooden hammer. What's what's the difference? Wooden bow. Okay, so I'm able to get a breastplate. And you right click to equip. So, I, oh okay, I got an achievement. Wood wall. Okay. Can I make more? Okay, are these stackable? Yes. Okay, so items on here are stackable. And I'm able to make a wall. That's... I dig it. But I think enemies can still go through them. So, not the most effective wall. 
Yes, they are. So what's the point of having that wall down? The enemies can go through. Do I have to get like a fence? So let's see. Uh, I know there's a fence up here. Wooden door. Okay, so let's get a wooden door. And let's see what happens with the door. So, when you swing it like this, when it's high, you're able to kind of do, okay. So, with the door, I don't understand, can I place it anywhere I want, or does it have to be on a fence, or what's the deal with that? I have a wall, but I guess you can't place it on a wall. I'm confused. So, what's up with this? Is it like a kind of. Well, is there a way that I can take it down? No? Okay, so once you place stuff, it's there permanently. And I believe that these guys can still go through your fences, which is extremely dumb. Think about it, it's there for your protection. Ah. Okay, so five. How do I place the door then? If I can't place it against a wall or a fence, how do I place the door? Okay, so I'm trying to figure out how to make a shelter. If I get just a, an average stone block, can I do that? So I can place down stone blocks and those are actual walls. Okay. So the only, I guess, So let's see. Okay. Okay, so I think Okay, so now I have it so it's kind of more protective. So I actually have protection now. That's useful. I actually have protection. Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm just gonna to make a little stairway. Real quick. So these guys can't get through, which is good. Right, how hard they try. Try to make a little staircase too. Ah. So what we're gonna try right now is kind of just having like a little little spot. Can I place a door right here? Would that be allowed? Is this so? Awesome. Okay. So we can actually make an underground base. And I think to interact with it, how, how would I 
How do I open it? Close it. Uh, let's see. Oh, shift. Uh, I'm confused. So how do I how do I open it? Do I need to? Oh, okay. So I right click. And then. Awesome. Okay. So I have a little staircase already made. Okay, so have more protection. It's a lot more safer now. The only problem would be the flying the flying brain things. I'm gonna make this wall actually a bit higher. Okay. Okay. And then probably place our workbench. Right. Let's actually place it. Let's place it inside, why not? Uh, can we make a torch? Because light would be very useful right now. Okay, so you can actually have. It's like a handheld torch. Awesome, that's way better. And then I think we can place them wherever we want, right? should okay that's a lot better so now let's make this let's make this a bit more roomy actually before we place any torches let's actually make this a bit more better too This uh, concludes Terraria Part 1, Bobna F51 Gaming. If you like this video, uh, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you ever if you already haven't. Uh, we will be coming out with more uh, Terraria ones. This actually seems like a pretty fun game. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. There will be more soon. Thank you for watching.